Okay, good morning everyone. My name is Bruno Hagebart. I'm the Risk uh, and Vulnerability Lead for the International Federation of the Red Cross. I'm going to talk about the uh, roadmap to community resilience that we have developed recently. This uh, Ignite stage will be different from the others, I can promise, so do stay with us because it's going to be one that you will not easily forget. Uh, last year, we developed a, uh, a roadmap to community resilience, which was a, uh, a further development of the IFRC framework for community resilience that we developed uh, uh, two years before that. I mean, there was a strong demand from the Red Cross to develop some operationalization of community resilience. So we, uh, we worked on that one in a, in a document which is called Roadmap to Community Resilience and which is explained in these different stages. What we did is we uh, identified the different elements of a resilient community and there's six characteristics. One is that a community needs to be knowledgeable, healthy and can meet its basic needs to be able to withstand shocks and stresses. It has to be socially cohesive as well, so there has to be collaboration between the different uh, members of the community. It has to have economic and job and livelihood opportunities. It has to be uh, uh, accessible infrastructure and, and services, and it needs to manage its natural assets and be well connected. What we also found is that we need to rethink the whole Red Cross and Red Crescent engagement. Uh, we need to work more uh, in an accompaniment with communities, more uh, giving them the lead, giving them the ownership of, of the process and not the Red Cross providing the services only. We also need to enable them, build capacity, but in the end let them decide and run the show and then connect the communities. So additionally, the Red Cross has worked, was more inward looking. For the last few years, we have promoted partnerships and collaboration. And then we developed this uh, roadmap to community resilience which has over 20 stages and seven milestones, and it has four stages. So. What was that all of a sudden? No. Uh, just to conclude, we're running this program in 12 countries now. We've done a training on it. And if you want to hear more, 
about it. We have a booth upstairs on One Billion Coalition, and you can contact the Red Cross colleagues on the roadmap to resilience. And if you want to embark with us upon the road to resilience, please join us again for another dance. Welcome. Can you play the music again, please? Music? Okay. It's not this one. Okay. Okay, there's something going wrong technically, but we try to play the right music. So, no? But he can play the music. Can you do the music? Can you play the music? Con esto. Okay, vamos a bailar. Thank you so much, Mexican Red Cross, Juventud. Muchas gracias.